Hello everybody, welcome to this quick review of uh, Linux Mint version 17 Kuyana. Uh, this is of course the Cinnamon uh, version and this is the uh, release candidate actually, the final version should be out in a week and version 17 of Linux Mint is based on Ubuntu 14.04 so uh, let's just check out what is under the hood in this release uh, we have the latest version of the Cinnamon desktop environment, version 2.2.9 and we are shipping a fresh kernel, uh, version 3.13, the same version that Ubuntu is also using in their latest release. And this version of Cinnamon comes with a lot of bug fixes and overall it looks a little bit more polished than the last version. Uh, as you can see, the start menu has some changes to it, um, the way the icons and everything is arranged. I personally think this looks better than what they had before, so uh, congrats on that. Um, as far as the applications go, of course we have Firefox as the default browser, uh, LibreOffice is shipping with it, graphics we have GIMP, um, you have IRC clients with it, Thundermail as your mail client, Pigeon for uh, IRC, ICQ, MSN, all that. Comes with VLC pre-installed, Prozero as the uh, CD burning program and Banshee as the music uh, management application. Not just the start menu was updated, also the whole Mint X theme looks a little bit more polished. Um, but now, let's just look at some of the core system applications and uh, this is something I really like about this release. They have uh, upgraded some of these internal system tools, such as the software sources, uh, the GUI management tool. So if you're uncomfortable editing the source.list files, this is a cool little tool. Uh, you can select your official repositories from here, of course. Then you can easily enable backport repositories or unstable repositories. You have an easy overview of your third-party repositories, of your auth authorized keys. And it's really uh, easy to understand for everybody. And I like the way this is done. I wish they had this uh, in Ubuntu. Another thing that was improved was the update manager. Click that. Um, in my case, all packages are up to date, but here you could usually see uh, an overview of what needs to be upgraded. Old version, new version, if there is a decrease or increase in size. And you also have here the uh, history of updates. As you can see, I already updated everything here. So also liking this little new update manager. And they also have a neat little new login screen. Um, can't show that now because the video recording program would stop. Then of course we have uh, some new wallpapers in here included. Some neat stuff of course. So this is Linux Mint uh, version 17. Overall I like the release so far. Looking forward to the other spins. Uh, right now there is only the Cinnamon and the uh, Mate or Mate uh, release out. KDE and the XFCE release should be out uh, in a month or so. So uh, be sure to check it out, especially if you're a fan of Cinnamon, I guess this is a must-have upgrade. Polished theme, polished application launcher, cool stuff. Had no uh, hardware issues whatsoever, everything worked just out the box, my Wi-Fi, my sound card, no issues at all. Cool release. And uh, if you want to see more Linux uh, desktop distro reviews, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And let me know in the comments what you think of this release.